Association brings more communities together to do good. And one of the ways to do this is through the Young Social Entrepreneurs Program. The Young Social Entrepreneurs Program started in 2010 to inspire, equip and enable youth to embark on social, social enterprises in Singapore and beyond. This experience has been very dynamic and uh, we have a lot of opportunities to interact with uh, on-the-ground workers as well as other companies and social enterprises around. Uh, it's been very enriching. Uh, this experience has also taught me about, uh, about the ecosystem um, in India as well as drawing insights from there to reflect back on my social enterprise in Singapore. My inspiration would be basically interacting with all the kids around here and finding out what's the actual social problem that we face and as social enterprises, how do we target them and provide an acute solution to these problems. Uh, my role model would be Terence from Project Happy Fit. He has been a mentor, has been teaching me a lot on business as well as entrepreneurship. So I would like to thank him over here as well. encouraging to see the Singapore International Foundation bring young social entrepreneurs from the ASEAN region to India for a learning experience. Both our regions are very, very similar in the context and challenges that they face. So the very fact that they've come here to learn from uh, Indian NGOs and Indian experts is very, very useful to take some of that knowledge back to the region uh, for the wider development of ASEAN. So I think it's very, very heartening to see an initiative like this and I wish Singapore International Foundation all the very best. The entire experience so far has been enriching. Eye-opening, enlightening. Today we had the Dasha session. We learned how to make an effective elevator pitch. And we learned what goes into an elevator pitch so that it's easily comprehensible to anybody that we meet and present to in the future. We also know that an elevator pitch doesn't just happen in an elevator. It can happen in many, many contexts. Like when we speak to various stakeholders, like investors, teachers, students, various other kinds of audiences. Hi, the entire YC experience has been very enlightening, it's been very insightful and fun. So when I think about the one key success factor that all social enterprises should have is that you need to make sure that the team is really committed into doing what they want to do. So team, your team, make sure you form a really good team and the team has to be solid and most importantly it has to be they have to be really committed into making this come true and then the one the one thing which i think about india when people ask me is that first it's very hot and then but then i'll say it's not the most beautiful place i've been to but it's always the one place that i would always look back with the fondest memories ever